that this came to us from from one of our listeners. And so it comes to us from listener Ted, and I'm just going to go ahead and read Ted's Ted's message. And then we'll and then I'll give you the, the canonical question. So Ted writes, I was in airports and thinking about the buffet of germs, so many surfaces touched by so many people and all that. And then you go to the bath- bathroom that in the airport, not airplane and encounter more germs trying not to say toilet plume or oh, the fecal matter and wash your hands. Unfortunately, we're trying to save the planet. So the paper towel dispensers only give a tiny piece. Suppose you're in a hurry and don't want to wait for the sensor on the paper towel dispenser to shame you any longer. Is it risky to do an average, not perfect job washing your hands and then not fully dry them? So the, you know, the answer may be, again, Ted is speculating of this, drying your hands is purely for comfort, not for sanitation, but I su- suspect that it's more complicated. So the canonical question here is, and, and again, let me, let me get it out because I think the context matters, mm-hmm. not drying hands fully, risky or not. And, and I'll tell you that this has come up and I've thought about it where on a few occasions I have either encountered in a public restroom, no paper towel source and just one of those terrible air blowers, Don, like this is me talking, not Mm -hmm. Ted. 